Right, good morning. Windy one today. Um, so today what we're doing is installing some instant hedging. So as you can see, I've dug a trench. Instant hedging comes in these one metre troughs. And it's just a case of uh, popping it in. And eventually, we'll be looking like this. Okay, so let's crack on. Make a start. So there's just a few things you need uh, to actually install. It's really straightforward. I use one of these uh, trenching tools here uh, for digging the trench because funny enough the width of the head of that is exactly the same as what you need in there so it's really simple you just you know dig that out I've already done it so there's not really much to show you but um, yeah really really easy links to this uh, on Amazon uh, in the description I've also uh, been using my ever faithful never bend Spear and Jackson uh, spade as well. This is also a trenching shovel, so it's really good for cutting down these edges, getting everything marked out uh, before you then dig everything out uh, with the other tool. And then finally, uh, we've got a bit of fertilizer. We've got some uh, stout gloves because um, these are hawthorn and holly, so they're a little bit spiky. Uh, we've also got a leatherman tool for cutting the um, plastic band off. Uh, and we've got some secateurs for just tidying up afterwards. So let's get cracking. Right, so one of the first things I like to do is to get one of the um, the troughs and just stick it in the hole and just see how that's going to come out. So you can see down here, that actually that's already on the bottom, but we're actually a couple of inches uh, up on the top there. So what I need to do is dig a little bit out. So that's where the, uh, the old trenching tool comes in uh, really handy. So let's get rid of that. Right, got really hard clay here, so it's not a lot of fun. Let's see how we get on. Yeah, there we go. So he's sitting in there perfectly now. Now we'll be able to get one of these uh, troughs of hedge in. So one of the things we need to do is just pop some fertilizer in the trough there, in the trench. Let's get some of that in. Lovely job. Right. So you'll see that these uh, these hedges, troughs, are from um, Ready Hedge up in Pershaw. Delivered them this morning. And you come with, this is, I think they're, they do, I mean, they do numerous uh, different varieties of hedging. But what I've done here, what I've gone for here, is um, uh, one of their um, mixed native hedges. So we've got hawthorn in here, we've got some holly, uh, we've got some hornbeam, and so it's a really nice mix that is uh, semi-evergreen on the hornbeam, evergreen on the holly, and then the really vigorous um, uh, hawthorn which makes it uh, really thick and bushy. So, right, all we need to do is snip uh, this little plastic strap off 
and then just uh, just pop him in. My little trick for doing this is to just kick it off. There we go. Let's get rid of that then. There we go. Uh, it sometimes they come with a few sticks. Uh, these were used for um, the irrigation at the, at the nursery. I like to push those in just below the surface so that uh, it just gives it a bit of support before the roots take. So what we'll do is all that um, waste that we just dug out of the pit um, I'll then bring back at the end and then we'll cover that up so it's all nicely bedded in. But that is essentially how you plant one level of instant hedge. So we've just got quite a bit more to do. So we better crack on. So the best thing you can try and do uh, when you're doing this sort of job is to get yourself a bit of a rhythm going. So we've already partially excavated this bit. So let's do the old uh, trough test. Yeah, I mean, I would say that is pretty much that. I reckon it just needs a little bit taken out. Yeah, we've got a little bit of a lump there. So we'll just take that out, even it all up a bit. And then we can get the next one in. Yeah, he looks good. Let's get that next one in. Here's an example of why you need to be wearing the gloves. Where is he? There he is. Look at that. Yeah, I just went in my hand. Oy. Look at that. Look at that little bugger. Let's get the notch mat out. So yeah, you can see it's important to get these edges butted right up. Make sure there's no air gaps in there. Uh, and then you can just use these irrigation sticks. Push, drive those in and then that gives it all a little bit more stability. So there we are, there's two metres of native hedging done. Several more to go. really happy no problem those roots are going to go in absolutely perfect
Right, there we are, that's three metres in. You've probably seen enough of that. So I'll just now crack on, uh, put in the other 20 or so here, and um, we'll come back and have a look in a minute. Right, so there we have it. Uh, that's about 25 metres in total of mixed native hedging gone in. It's obviously started to rain now, so that's not a lot of fun. Uh, but you can see, in just a couple of hours, we've really managed to frame this driveway uh, and actually start to make things look a bit more mature. So there's only one last job to do, and that is to go back through and just, um, using the secateurs, just knock off any of these uh, bits that are really outstanding. So let's just have a look and see, so, you know, like he needs doing, get rid of him, uh, a couple of these bits, there we go, take him off, just anything that's really sticking out wildly, here you go, there's another chap down here, you know, you're a bit enthusiastic, let's get rid of you, this guy, this guy, him, uh, a couple more down here. There we go, we'll get rid of you. We'll get rid of you and you. Well, a couple more down here. There we are, you and you and you. And you. Yeah. Right, we just need to whip down this side as well. Don't think there's that much here. Get rid of you. You're a bit enthusiastic. And how are you looking? you in a bit. Get rid of that. There we are, you'll need removing, as will you. Uh, what have we got here? Yeah, that, that, that. Get rid of a couple of these guys as well. There we go. And then we can just straighten up this edge at the back and allow him to thicken up a bit. Right, so there we go. So thank you very much for watching this video. We've got a bit wet now, but say la vie. Um, that is how to install instant hedging. And if you would please uh, like and subscribe to the channel. Also head over to my website, lawnmowingbusiness.co.uk, where I've got loads and loads of articles on how uh, you can start your own successful lawn mowing business. Um, so please head over there and subscribe to the newsletter to get updated when any new articles go live. So thanks very much. See you in a bit.